This is a $30 mouse from AliExpress. 4K compatible, 49 grams, and it has a 33.95 sensor. So here we have the box, it's a pretty good box. It feels like a Pulsar box, to be honest. It feels very, very good. You got VXC on the side, the specs on the back, 3395, 250 mAh battery. So if we open it up. You get the user manual, you get a little card, you get the cord, and you get the mouse. And the mouse dongle is in the bottom. All right, so here we have it. Uh, wow, it feels extremely solid. This is very solid. The shape feels absolutely fantastic. It feels almost like a Pulsar X2, more than a Razer Viper Mini, which I've seen them compared. So it feels more like a uh, X2 Mini. But yeah, 49 grams, 33.95. It has good comfort grooves on the mouse, on the mouse main buttons as well. Good side buttons. It feels extremely solid. The skates are extremely good as well. You have the off button. You have a 2.4 gigahertz button for the dongle and you have Bluetooth on this. You can also change the DPI from the bottom. So here we go, it's on now. Plug the dongle in. And there you go, it already works. So there is a software for it called Viho, and it's a pretty good software, but it's all in Chinese, sadly. But you can pretty much just figure it out. But yeah, VXC R1. You can change all the buttons, see what they do. Now let's test it in-game. Okay, so now after I put a couple of hours on the mouse, I have come to the conclusion that this is probably the best gaming mouse you can get around $30. This absolutely destroys something like the Dharma Shark M3, which feels just like complete Chinese trash after you try the VXA R1. But yeah, for $30, this is probably the best gaming mouse you can get. You can get the 4K dongle as well for around $12 on AliExpress. I hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.